Hello, Colors. Welcome back to Viva Barca, the home of everything Barcelona, where we are going to be discussing on the very latest on FC Barcelona. As usual, we are going to start with this fresh report from ESPN claiming that Barcelona plan to meet with Ronald Arago's agent again in the coming days to discuss a contract extension. Of course, amid rising interest in his services from Manchester United and Liverpool. We are going to be discussing much on that report as we progress. Secondly, talking about Pablo Torre. Of course, Pablo Torre who was signed and is now playing for the Barca B. The youth coordinator of Racing Santander, and Pablo Torre's former club, has recently shared some insight about the player's brilliance. We are going to be discussing on that as well. Then thirdly, talking about Bayern Munich goal machine Robert Lewandowski. Amid serious interest from Barcelona, and of course, his contract standoff with um, Bayern Munich. It has been reported that the player is frustrated with how things are going with his employers. And Sport is reporting that Lewandowski is considering a move to Barcelona. We are going to be discussing on that and also the details of the potential contract offer review. We are going to be looking at that in much detail. So guys, as we get right into it, please endeavor to subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, we are on our way to 10,000 subscribers. I'll be really happy. If you do well to subscribe, give the video a like and make sure to watch the video right up to the very end. Barca, Barca, Barca. Barcelona plans to meet with Ronald Arago's agents in the coming days to discuss a contract extension with Premier League clubs Liverpool and Manchester United. Monitoring the situation, sources have told ESPN. Arago is out of contract in 2023 and initial talks to renew his terms at the Camp Nou have failed to yield an agreement. Barca won the Uruguayan defender to stay at the club and will restart talks with his camp imminently in the hope of striking a deal. Sources explain that Barca's offer is worth around 5 million euros annually and the club remains confident Arago will eventually renew his terms. However, at first revealed by ESPN in November, Liverpool and United remain interested in Arago and are ready to make their move if talks with Barca stall. The money on a table in England is worth almost double Barca so far. Sources say both sides, Barca and the player, will need to give a little to reach an agreement. Arago's preference is to remain at Barca, no doubt. He first joined the club's B team from Boston River back in 2018 and was promoted to the first team in 2020. He emerged as a key player over the last two seasons, playing as both a centre-back and a right-back under Xavi. In total, he has made 72 appearances for the first team, scoring 6 goals, including the second in the last weekend's 4-0 um, trashing over Real Madrid in Clasico. Arago is not the only Barca player whose contract is coming to an end. Gavi's terms are also due to expire in 2023. You know, why Usman Dembele, Dani Alves and Sergio Roberto will all walk away for nothing this summer if they don't sign new deals. With the countless number of meetings that Barca have been holding with the representative of Ronald Arago, that nothing has yielded fruit so far, we just hope that with this latest development from ESPN, we hope that this, you know, this upcoming meeting will bring the desired result, that we all the fans will be happy about it because it has been dragging on and on since last year. And now we're getting um, Barca preparing 5 million from their initial 3 million. Hopefully, Arago considers that. But if he doesn't consider, then there will be a problem there. But we hope that everything goes on well. Of course, Gavi, Gavi's own renewal is also pending. Barca are also trying to see how they will do about that. But for now, Arago's renewal is taking center stage. Then on to the next story of discussion. Pablo Torre is a special player, at least according to Barca and a youth coordinator from his parent club. That's the reason Barcelona made sure to sign him and his time at Racing Santander made sure to turn some heads. Gonzalo Cosa, the coordinator of the youth team at Racing, spoke about Torre's long-term talent and the talent of the young star. Going by his words, we want to try and create the maximum number of players for the first team. Later, a Pablo Torre comes and if you can sell him for 5 million euros, it's very welcome. But people should know it's impossible. 
It's something that happens every 10 or 15 years, he said. There are two players who you could see what they are capable of for years. These things don't just happen overnight. There are two players who are very different from the rest of their teammates. They make the difference and they have always been at the forefront of their generation. Each one has had their difficulties, but sooner or later, they had to go because they had the talent for it. That's the words from the youth coordinator they are racing. So there is no doubt of the, the raw talent Pablo Torre possesses. Now we just wait and hope he gets the necessary chances to shine as he develops. Then on to the final story of discussion. In a fresh report providing an update on Barcelona's hunt for a new striker, Sport reports that Bayern Munich superstar Robert Lewandowski will consider joining Barcelona in the summer. It is no secret that Barcelona have been on the lookout for a marquee striker to lift their project under Xavi Hernandez. Erling Haaland was a top target for the club, but the finances involved in the deal and the competition for his signing have made the deal impossible. Barcelona, as a result, are already looking at possible alternatives, with Lewandowski emerging as one. The veteran striker is widely regarded as one of the most prolific goal scorers in the game, thanks to his exploits with Borussia Dortmund and Bayern Munich. The 33 year old, though, is entering the final year of his deal with the Bavarian Giants and is considering making one final move in his career. And Barca have emerged as a potential destination for the Hitman, who is ready to take the next big step in his career. As per the report, Robert Lewandowski believes that signing for a club like Barcelona would help him gain even more reputation and recognition outside of Germany, while also helping him win the Ballon d'Or. Why he has always held a desire you know, to join a club of the statue of Barca or Real Madrid, circumstances in the past did not allow it. But with him entering the final year of his contract at Bayern, there is a window of opportunity for Barcelona to swoop. It is further stated that Lewandowski's agent, Pini Zahavi, has a good relationship with Barca president Juan Laporta, which could boost the club's chances of landing the player. Now, talking about the details of the contract Barcelona's offer for Robert Lewandowski, Barcelona for their part have already made their first move in an attempt to sign the player as per different um, report from Sport. According to the update, Barca have offered the Polish a four-year contract that would run until 2026, despite the striker being set to turn 34 years old in August later this year. In addition to that, the club would make the Bayern Munich superstar the center of his project under Xavi, despite the recent exploits of another former Dortmund striker in Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Barca believe that signing Lewandowski will be financially much more feasible than Haaland due to his contractual situation at the Allianz Arena, along with his own desire to test himself at a new club. If Barca are successful in their pursuit for the 33-year-old, it will be nothing short of a huge coup. So colors, with that we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Hope you did enjoy the video and also hope you did subscribe. If you haven't, please make sure to do so. So you always stay in touch with the latest on FC Barcelona here on Viva Barca. Until next time, bye-bye.